Sorry I'm late, I've been a uh, crazy day. Come on, come in, Pier 31, home of the plastiki. Ah. I think the first inspiration for the plastiki was really stumbling across this report that the UN had put out about the fragility of our deep oceans and the accumulation of marine debris. And then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, I'm reading a report about this human fingerprint, this eastern garbage patch, which is floating uh, ominously in the Northeast Pacific. And so here it was, this amazingly disgusting kind of manifestation of modern consumerism swirling across our oceans, yet it wasn't being discussed. So after seeing this and being inspired by this, I decided how could I try and, and, and create an energy that would solve this. The dream started as, um, you know, very simply saying, could I build a boat made entirely of plastic bottles to sail across the Pacific? And from that sort of curious notion, um, the, the adventure began. That was back in 2006. Three years later, we are now getting close to putting her in the water, which will be a pretty momentous day. But it's been so far a phenomenal journey of understanding, exploring, learning, unlearning, relearning, and sharing ideas to create a vessel that will showcase waste as a resource, will, will hopefully highlight the fact that maybe it isn't plastic that is to blame, but it really is our inability to understand the material, how we use it, what we're using it for, and more importantly, how we dispose of it so that it doesn't end up in our oceans. I think the takeaway message for the skimmers is let's just beat waste. I think if you really want to get involved, you start to look at it and say, let's make waste a resource and you start to reduce, reuse, recycle, but obviously rethink. And finally, if you're a real diver and you want to get really involved in the plastiki, you fundamentally start to change your perception of your role on this planet to lessen your human fingerprint. And that doesn't just mean with waste, that means with our consumption of natural resources, that means our use of energy, our use of water. It means understanding that as a species, we are totally dependent on the vitality of our natural environment. And without that, we cannot live on this planet as we know it.